All right, y'all, so you already know what time it is. You know, as you can see, I'm outside with it. You feel me? Shout out to everybody on the journey. Continue the journey. Yo, we got to stay motivated. We got to stay focused. It hit different. When you do your homework on how important it is to stay focused, bro, it's going to be something that's going to hit different every single time. When you're on this retention journey, it's the same thing, bro. Speaking of being on the journey, bro, a lot of people have been hitting me up as recently, man. Some people are telling me that they're not experiencing the female attraction at all. You know, I know some people who, you know, been following my channel for a while and, you know, they be hitting me up like, yo, I still haven't experienced a female attraction. What am I doing wrong? This, that, and the third. Now, if you actually want to know what exactly you're doing wrong, definitely hit me up type shit. You feel me? I do consultations. All right. If you really want to know, because I have to see what you doing, literally, you feel me? As far as like what you do on a daily basis, where do you go? Do you even go out in public for women to even see you like that? So there's a couple things that I guess we all can do just in case, you know, if you don't, if you haven't experienced a female attraction, there's a couple things you can do to, to actually be seen. You feel me? Number one, you got to have the natural confidence within you knowing that like in any social setting, you can vibe. Okay. You also need to be hanging out with like-minded individuals, people who, you know, if you like basketball, start, start going to the court and start hooping with some dudes that, that, that hoop. Because what's going to happen is when you're around different groups of people, especially if you're around the guys, yeah, you're going to hear about certain events that are happening. You feel me? If you're constantly just in the house, okay, yeah, you're on retention, you're in the house, but you're not doing nothing with your life. How do you expect to have the female attraction? Women, all, like most girls, like to have fun. You, you heard of that saying? Uh, girls just like to have fun. Bro, you have to bring some, some excitement to... You know what I'm saying? First of all, not to her, but to your life. You have to be fun by yourself. Can you be fun? Can you be creative? Can you, you know what I'm saying? Can you like work on certain projects and shit? Could you go out, travel and learn? Think when you start to really be active in the matrix, not just go out to the club, not just go to school, not just go to work. When you really start, you know, doing different things, excuse me, as far as like creative wise, you had I'm telling you, that's when the women are going to see you. And you have to understand, too, bro. Seamer attention and, and, and have an experience in the female attraction will happen. But the only reason why it happens is because you are vibrating in a high vibrational rate. What does that mean? You are in your higher self. When you're in your higher self, you're getting you're taking care of business. You don't even have time to wonder, like, damn, is a girl thinking about me? Damn, when am I going to get a female attraction? You feel me? Have a balance in your life. Eat healthy. Make sure you can do something outside of the matrix that's like that that doesn't have to deal with work or anything like that. Make sure you can go to a decent social setting, you know what I'm saying? Depending on where you live at. And that's that's key too. Depending on where you live at, that that's 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 also very important. Uh whether or not you're going to experience a female attraction, bro. But bro, put all that to the side. Put the female attraction and shit all to the side, bro. Generally speaking, somebody would want to be a part of your life if they see that you're doing good in life. If they see that you're going up, if you're doing what you got to do, you're working on yourself, that's when the female attraction happens. But you, but, but by the time you get there, it, it really wouldn't even fucking matter. Because now you're in your element, you're doing what you got to do. Imagine you going retention to have the female attraction and then you get that. And then all of a sudden now you don't know even you don't even know how to handle that. You become a shell of yourself, right? It's still possible, bro. Just because you go on retention for 100 days, that don't mean like after, you know, you start a new street, you you uh, you won't fall back into some of your old ways. That's this is why it's a retention journey, bro. It's a journey. This shit. It's almost it really don't stop. It really don't stop. But make sure you're doing it for you, bro whether you get the female attraction or not that's number one don't fix your mind on saying like man okay i got that loud pack but ain't nobody trying to you know what i'm saying ain't nobody messing with the loud it hit different when it went when it's not you know what i'm saying they not messing with the loud for real half the time though your mindset is off and you still come off as being thirsty it don't make no sense being on this journey when in your mind 
you still, the same things are still playing in your mind. You're still thinking about, man, that girl this, or man, I can't wait to do this or do that. The time when you feel those urge, urges, you should be transmuting that energy, though, into, into, into something positive as far as like, okay, boom. Instead of feeling the urge to do this, I, mean, I have to shift my, my uh, mindset instantly because the more I think about being on this or being on the urge and shit, now your body's reacting like, okay, well, the more you suppress it, the more it's going to come up. You feel me? So it's like you have to understand your body, your body chemistry, and you have to almost, it's almost like you have to trick your mind into, you know, because it's not even really tricking your mind. It's really tricking your body low key into saying like, you know what? I don't need this in my moment, right? I mean, right. I don't need this type of action in my life right now because me doing this over and over again is not helping me elevate myself okay so once you tell your body you once you tell yourself that and you have control over your body over your flesh now you have more power now you have more willpower i should say now you have more confidence i should say now when you get into a hard situation you around a female you know what to say and how to say it and how to govern yourself the right way I'm telling you, bro, like, do it for you. Do it because you know uh, everything will improve in your life. How you talk, how you walk, how you think, how you eat, how you sleep, the quality of sleep, all of that is going to change for you when you practice semen retention, you know? And the female attraction is just a byproduct of, of you being on the journey. Some of y'all won't probably even find your, 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 the girl that you uh, need in your life until two, three years from now, bro. Some, it might be five years from now, bro. Dead ass, bro. It might be five, six years. You may never know. And what if that is the case? What, you just going to not live life? What, just because you're not experiencing the female attraction, you're not going to go to work? So you're not worried about next year? You're not worried about the year after that? Sometimes what you got to do from now working on yourself now doing the shadow work now probably won't show until a year later two years later you know everybody has a different window of time of experiencing their blessings man we can't look at somebody else's journey and be like okay well he got it at this time now i need to get it at this time again if you really want to chop it up with me type shit bro you could definitely dm me uh on my on my, on my instagram and you know i i do consultations and we could talk we could chop it up bro you just have to ask yourself the right questions man and look at what you're doing over and over again as to why you feel quote unquote quote unquote alone or you're not experiencing the female attraction you probably to be totally honest man it's a confidence thing one of course this uh you know it depends on where you live at you know of course, you want to make sure like, you know, if you don't live in a major city like Miami, New York, Chicago, Atlanta, Los Angeles, if you're not in no major city, of course, it varies from where you live at. But if you do live in a small town, too, trust and believe, right? It's some decent women out there, but they most of them, I ain't going to hold you because sometimes I've been thinking like, damn, bro, even in the beginning of my retention journey, I was like, damn, I live in I lived in central Florida. And I was like, I want to experience nothing, bro. Ain't nobody here. Where everybody at? The fuck going on? You know what I'm saying? I'm thinking like, you know, what's going on? Like, but what I realized is that, um, I realized that no matter where you at, there's women everywhere. But what I had to start doing was going out. I had to start becoming more active. I had to say, you know what? Let me enjoy life. Okay. I've been working hard. All right. I got my little funds or whatnot. I can go out. I can chill. You know what I'm saying? Not going to a place where it's low vibrational because I'm telling you right now, that's just like, you're just going to be moonwalking backwards. You know what I'm saying? So you might as well try to find different places. I'm, I'm going to make a separate video about that as far as social spots y'all can go to to help, you know, kind of transmute your energy when you feel some type of way. But yeah, when you start doing that, the universe, it's just like a chain reaction in the universe. You probably will go out and won't meet no females, but because you're going out and you're utilizing your energy you're getting the momentum going so now you might be at your job you just get off from work you go home or not even go home you go stop by a store to get some shit and then you might run into a female and you not you might not even be ready yeah i remember when i made that video about how i seen a finance female and i froze up like a motherfucker 
You want to know why I froze up? Because number one, I wasn't ready. Okay. Number two, um, it's been a minute for me. You know what I'm saying? Since I've actually cold approached the cold approached the female type shit. Like just walked up to her, like yo X Y Z. I ain't gonna lie. A B C one two three. You feel me? But even when that, sometimes that might happen, bro. You might have to take an L. I know I took an L that day, but I probably dodged a bullet too. You see what I'm saying? But you see how life is? Shit happens when you don't be ready. So the female attraction is actually going to happen when you least expect it. So you have to be ready at all times, bro. Period. Whether it happens or not. So just keep that in mind, bro. You feel me? MGT, what to it do? It's your boy Moody Star and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do, man. Become a subscriber. Like the video, enjoy the MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this beautiful, fucked up, sideways ass matrix. Now, first of all, I gotta say a special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, this is what we do. We work on ourselves every single day. Intro for the outro. Yo, definitely hit me up, bro. If y'all really want to chop it up, we could definitely do that. But just in case, you know, uh, you know, you don't have time for that, just understand, bro be active no matter what stay ready no matter what and i promise you bro you just the confidence of you going out and being who you are it's e women will easily notice you bro they'll easily notice you and remember too not all the time where you could be in your guy life force energy that like okay you chilling that a female's gonna come up to you and be like hey i ain't gonna lie you fine as hell uh can you can 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 i have your number time a woman is not gonna do that shit they're afraid to be rejected so guess what, my guy? You still got to step. You still might have to step. If you find, if you see the, uh, she's giving you choosing signals and you have the confidence and you're, you're in a moment in time in life where like, okay, my job and school is going good. And okay, of course, I want a female friend to chop it up with and talk to. Go ahead. Do it. This It's really on you. A lot of times, guys be like, man, I don't experience the female attraction. But you're not doing shit to do it, to, 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 for it to happen. You can't just sit back and think of females are just, oh, he's retaining. He's retaining. Oh, you feel me? Nah, they ain't finna do that, bro. You got to be a little bit more strategic than that. Just sitting back. You know what I'm saying? Trust and believe, bro. It's, it's, it, it happens every single time. I know when I, especially when I, when I'm, um, when I'm really in that focus mode of like, you know what I'm saying? put all the bs to the side that's when all everything want to start coming in my reality all of a sudden but just stay focused bro regardless understand why you're doing it whether you experience the female attraction or not you still have to stay in your god life force energy type of vibe no matter what and on that note on that note i'm gonna definitely see you guys on the next video peace